We're uh, chilling at the No Limit Studios in Amsterdam Southeast right now. I'm together with my boy Joey Switch. Hey, yo, Switch, man, what you been up to lately? Yeah, just DJing, man. You know, I'm full-time DJ, so producing, DJing, clubs, parties, festivals, things like that. <laughs> business right now we're here to introduce uh, a brand new DVS uh, package called cross pack uh, which is basically from uh, mix vibes you've been playing with DVS a long time right now uh, uh, so you got a good opinion on what uh, cross advantages might be over other products so what do you think yeah no I've started uh, playing with DVS ever since 2000 yeah. the first one came out and um, till now, so that's like almost 10 years of experience with uh, stuff like this. But what I like about this one is uh, it's compatible with every uh, sound card. You know, you don't have to use the Serato box or you don't have to use the Final Scratch box or whatever box there is. Uh, you can use like a regular sound card. You know, you can just buy, go to the store and just buy a sound card and it works. All right, so that's really nice. So it works with every sound card. So you can get it like from a range from $100 to whatever money you can afford. What I really like is the, the loop uh, feature. Uh, that is so great, man. I used like Serato, I used Final Scratch, but this uh, cross pack is like special. If you make a loop and you shift it to like a, a, a zero, it still plays the loops. Ah, so you, oh yeah, I know that one, because I've been DJing uh, as well, of course. Uh, you mean when you ship the loop, you press the loop in, loop out, and you uh, adjust the loop out point to zero, the other systems, they tend to uh, uh, break out of the loop, sort of. So when you get to the zero point, uh, it just starts playing the music again, which is something, obviously, you don't like when you're triggering some kind of build-up effect or something. So is there any uh, any other features in the package that you really like? Yeah, I like the uh, the iTunes feature. That's like great. It's, it looks like iTunes. I think it is iTunes. I don't know how they did it, but it is. I think it is iTunes in the program. All right, so I get it. So the other programs do have iTunes integration, but this doesn't just integrate it, but it also looks like iTunes, which is, of course, a nice feel if you're used to iTunes. What do you think about the overall stability of the Cross software? You know, um, I've been using Final Scratch for a while. I've been using Serato for a while. Now I'm using Mix Vibes, and, you know, it's equal. I don't... I don't yeah, I think it's equal and maybe even better because if you look at the price, it's much cheaper and you know, you got like the same or maybe more st uh, stability. Yeah, and of course the, the whole uh, special CD timecode, which is of course not a ripoff of the final uh, timecode such as the, the competitors do, right? Yeah, yeah, that's true. They make like a, a, a exact copy of the, uh, the record, the final record to the CD and this is like a special made CD time code you know the, the time code the time code on this cd is like special made okay so that's that's basically why the loops work better with this system than the other uh, systems <laughs> So uh, uh, we've talked about the software, but we're actually for the launch of the Cross Pack. So what's in the pack, Joey? Uh, in the pack, you got like two final records, like two black ones, but I got like two different colors right here, like the orange one and the white one. Nice. Yeah, so basically, I think they have to make more colors, but this is like nice. And you know what? They feel great. It's not that that light and it's not that heavy, so they feel like really great. Yeah, they're actually regular 12 inches uh, pressed, right? Okay, great. Uh, you getting the CD? It uh, it looks like a final record, you know, and it don't look like a CD in the back. It's like black, 
So I think that's like the special feature of the CD. They made it specially for. Yeah, it actually looks like vinyl, like a vinyl CD. Pretty cool. And you get two, right? Yeah, you got two of these. Obviously. You got like your sound card. That's like really great. It's not that big. It's like really small. And it, it works fine though. It works fine. It's cheaper than all the other programs that, that, that we know nowadays. And it works equal. Okay, cool. So you got the sound card. It's, it's got like uh, three inputs, mic, uh, high Z, uh, phones is an output. Then you got on the back, you got two inputs and you get um, three outputs and a mix out basically. And an additional uh, feature of powering up your sound card in case uh, you might need it or your USB port doesn't give out uh, enough power. So basically a very rugged, small sound card, very sexy looking, so pretty good, right? And of course, you got the software with all the features on it. So, yeah, what more can I say? Go out and buy that. I, I want to thank my man Joey Switch for this interview. Uh, hope to see you soon and uh, be safe, man. Oh, 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 oh.